When was the last time you came since 2002? In Singapore? Yeah, many more times. Uh, many more times. Uh, last time I came, I uh, hope I'm not wrong, was uh, in December 15. We were on our way to Australia to visit uh, our uh, eldest son who was in Sydney at the time. And so we stopped and we had a very good, uh, very good evening here. So your eldest son followed the way of the father? No, not at all. No, no. Well, he's uh, not a... he, he's, he's, he's far cuter than I can be. He's taller and he's doing something very different. But he studied here for a little while at uh, SMU. Oh, in time, Singapore? Uh, for a few few months. And then he, he's done business school. Um, I, so they, they, they won't be winemakers. So you they make, won't be winemakers. make more money. Maybe make more money, be, be more successful, maybe. <laughs> but I, I like I like Singapore because we're lucky enough to have good friends here. Uh, they are the commandery, they are Sean, they are Potion, they are yeah, uh, you... many, many many friends here. And they are, the only thing is Singapore is uh, very on the focus of uh, the winemakers and the Grand Chateau and all that. So there are a lot of uh, opportunities for people here to have very good events. So the competition for events is quite tough in Singapore, but uh, on the other end, we the food is wonderful. Uh, we always get incredible moments, and so it's a great pleasure and privilege to be here. So, uh, Philip, uh, over over the period of time, uh, I think Potion invited you to be one of the uh, uh, Chinese Daily, uh, you know, distinguished guests in 2002. And uh, since then, have you uh, got any recollection of great pairing with, uh, you know, Chateau Béchaville wine with local cuisine? I've never been worried by that. I don't know example. Of, think, of, think of, of the of great moments uh, of of bad pairing. So it can be goose, it can be Peking duck, it can be anything. It works always. I'm very, I'm very, I'm very confident with that. You know, except maybe if you take some uh, shellfish or something, you know, a little bit too 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 fishy uh, to match the wine. Yes, I wouldn't recommend it. But for the rest, yep. it can be dumb, uh, dumplings. It would be very good. There's plenty of things which are very very good. And and I think the pairing is naturally good with uh, Chinese cuisine, which is so rich. You can have. Uh, you know, if it's not over spicy, yep. it won't kill the wine. Right. It has to be not over spicy as well. Maybe that's the thing uh, I would probably avoid if I had to recommend. So do you still run a marathon in two hours, 45 minutes? You've got a good book about me. Uh, no, I, I'm an old guy now. No, I, I, they say the older you are, the... I, I've been injured. Uh, I had back problems after running, maybe too much, I don't know. And so I ran my last marathon in 14 in Paris. 247 was in Paris as well, but a hey, long time ago it was in 03. That's, huh? In 03. 03? Yeah. Okay. I was 41, uh, but that was my best time. Okay. So now uh, I'm biking and I, I'm not running anymore. But I'm part of something which is very, very good in Medoc, which is called Marathon du Medoc. We've got 8,500 runners every, every year. Some people come from Singapore. We've got 70 different nationalities coming, and I'm part of that. So can you tell us the, the route of the marathon uh, in, uh, in Medoc? Where does it go of to? Of course I can tell you because I, I'm, that's my, my the, job there. You're, you're <laughs> the planner. A with a friend of mine, we, we, we are, we're the one deciding on the route. So, so you take them we, up the hill? We leave from Poyac yep. and we go down to Saint-Julien. So Becheveil is the southern point of the marathon. People drink can be offered some wines. We okay. open 250 bottles. So that's that's quite a bit. But and you've got 20 or 25 chateaus offering wines. Along so the it, way. Along the way. So it may start in Lynchbach, for example, then Pichon Longueville Baron, Pichon Comtesse, uh, Bechevel, then then it goes to La Grange, La Rose, La Grange, and going going, uh, going back up to Poyac, Grand Prix Lacoste. Uh, and then we go to, through Ponte Canet and Mouton Rothschild, Lafitte, where they offer a tasting as well. Up the, the, the big hill of Cosses Tournel, which is quite high, difficult, 26 kilometers, it hurts a little bit. And then all Saint Estef uh, properties, I'm sorry, they are numerous, but uh, <laughs> finishing with Monrose. Monrose. And back on the river uh, uh, banks and back to Poyac. And it's 42. Always a little bit longer than a marathon because we don't care. It's called the plus grand marathon du monde, the plus long marathon du monde, the longest marathon in the world. Wow! Because it's always more than 42.2 kilometers, 
and if people take their time or dance or eat oysters or meat and drink, they take them. They are very slow. Thank, thank you for the insight to the longest but most fun-filled marathon in the world. Check the website, marathondumedoc.com. Okay. Uh, and uh, thank you very much, uh, Philip, for this opportunity to uh, speak with you. It was my pleasure, and I wish uh, the viewers all the best. Okay. And I, again, welcome them, welcome them to come and visit us, because we are very open to, to see, to show people what we're doing and where we're doing it. Okay, thank, thank you so you. much. Au revoir. Have a yeah. very pleasant stay and tasting. Thank you so much. Okay. <laughs>